Well, it's been a little bit since the last update, so we're going to do a Neo update. Oh, pretty boy. Yeah. Oh, so vicious. So vicious. Yep, so vicious. How's your teeth doing, buddy? I know. We're trying to get you to the vet as soon as possible. Right now we're working with um, a local veterinarian and trying to see if we can get him in there. We're a little bit cheaper, so all we have to do is just pay for um, the stuff, uh, not for actually her time, which would be convenient. But he's doing pretty good. His teeth are definitely still messed up pretty bad. As you can see, he was biting me pretty decent and wasn't doing anything. Come here, Neo. Come here. I want to see your teeth. I want to see your teeth. Come here. Come here. I know. You're so... Yeah, he's... Here, come here. Yeah, you can see how his teeth are right there. They're pretty, pretty gnarly, so he's definitely needing to go into it pretty soon. There you go, boy. Have your, have your meal. There you go. Uh, come, on. come on, adjust. I hate my camera sometimes. Well, technically it's my phone. But, yeah, he's doing pretty good. Ah, now it's just too bright. Reset. There we go. And we got the little boy right here. And if you notice that my voice is a little bit better, it's because I actually bought something specifically for doing videos now. Which is one of those little, like, plug-in mic things. I don't know what brand it is, but basically it plugs into my phone, then I have a secondary one if I need to, like, do interviews or something like that. Which most likely maybe or may not happen. Who knows in the future. But we got the little boy right there. Got Grumpy Rand. Got Grumpy Rand. Hmm? Hmm? He's like, I'm outside. I don't want to be outside. I want to be inside where I can sleep. I don't have to listen to people or listen to things. But yeah. And then we got one of the little girls. Actually, I think that's the older sister right there. I've been spreading seed in here to try to get it to grow. And the only place it's growing is inside that like stick area and underneath this a little bit. But, yeah, I was just giving you guys an update on Neo. Um, as I said before, he will be going to the vet pretty soon. I don't know how much it's going to be. I do have a little bit saved up, so hopefully that's enough. And a couple of your guys' um, contributions have made it a little bit better, too. So, hopefully it's not too bad. I don't expect it to be too bad, considering that it's, like, between three to $400, I think. Um, for someone just going in there without a recommendation and getting it reduced by, you know, word of mouth kind of thing and helping out. So I'm hoping it's like under three, which would be nice because it's pretty much about as much as I have saved up right now with everybody, you know, like what my pay can be. But soon we're going to be also, um, rebuilding the outside enclosure on the back of Nye. So back there by the house, you see the shed right there. There's going to be another enclosure right there, and I'll show you guys in the future. I ran. Um, and what's going to end up happening is Neo is going to go out there. And once we build that, which is, it's kind of been like the weather, heat, and all that. It's been kind of keeping us doing, and me and my girlfriend's schedule overlapping. Um, after Neo can go in there, I'm going to actually be releasing the little boy and the girls. Wherever they went. There's one. There's one in there. But, yeah. So, they will be re being released the second we get that all set of, settled and done. So, you can look forward to that. And Neo and Rand will stay here. And Neo will stay depending on how his vet treatment goes. So, if they say officially he cannot be released. Because currently we have a no release paperwork right now for him. But, if his teeth can be fixed and he has no problems, then I am 100% okay with releasing him back in the wild. Because, personally, like everybody says, you should release them. And I'm, like, I know Rand. I love Rand. I'm not going to lie. I, what did you get? Is it an acorn? What? Oh, you. S wow. Thank you. Well, there goes the fluff part of my mic that I just had on me. So he, tore, he took the mic fluff off my chest and he tore it up you're a fucking brat you know that so the mic probably changed you are a silly little freaking brat 
piece of shit. Goddamn shark potato. Shark potato, you're not supposed to be tearing up stuff like this. Whatever. I love you anyways. But like I was saying, I feel sorry for um, them to be stuck inside and stuff like that, but that's why we have the big enclosure and all that. So I think I've rambled too much, so I'll see you in the next one.